understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that down. If I may. Come on, sir. Try to remember what really happened at Sylvia's Saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Ancient history. Done and dusted. The dead got off lucky. The living got to keep suffering. Same as always. But did you shoot the Newton twins? I don't give a pig's penis about the Newton twins. One of them was a girl, anyhow. But you had been friends back in 73. You rode the Alabaster Trail together. Funny thing about pigs' penises. They're curly like their tails. <laughs> Put that in your fucking book, Plato. <sighs> this isn't going very well. Apparently not. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm gonna write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame? <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. OK, then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters, legends, every last one. Emmett Granger, Flacco Hernandez, Billy Midnight, Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity, shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some... Sad, deluded fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. Like a hole in the head.
you. What do you want? Howdy. You Granger? That's my name. My occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. Weren't always like that, though, were you? Used to be a quick draw guy. You knew Jim Boy Calloway? Used to be's correct. Then there's a long over. And who might you be? Don't matter. I need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book about Jim Boy? <laughs> well, shit. I can't talk to you now. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. Well, don't mind me. We can talk while you work. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, young man like you get it done in half the time. I don't know about that. What's to know? You interested in the old days? If you shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. You keep your hands clean, I don't give you squat. God damn it. These better be some stories. Oh, they are. Pick up the fork and get to work. Or get out of here and stop wasting my time. I'm gonna do this for you, but I don't like it. Jim Boy weren't nothing, you know. Me? I killed men, women, and children, too. Animals? I even killed rocks. And I killed them good. I shot folks, stabbed folks, skinned folks. I scalped some. Boy, they scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. Don't know what's got into these hogs, but I know what's coming out of them. <laughs> I bash folks, butchered folks. I burn folks alive. Buried folks alive. One time, I... I get it, all right? You're me. What about Callaway? Now it's clean enough to eat off. Uh, I guess I'm done. You get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. All right. No shortage of shit round here. Comes from hungry hogs and no hands. Uh, uh, hell, uh, that stinks. <laughs> okay, I cleaned up your mess. Go on, tell me about Callaway. I said I'd tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't trifle with me, old man. You knew him. Just give me something, anything. You're making a book, you should make it about me. They're just words, is all. Give me something to say and I'll leave you alone. You owe me that. Hey, you be careful. <sighs> Killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. One hey, time... You know I... what? I don't think you were anything at all. Just a crazy old man. I ain't a killer? Well, you'd already be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the Federals got this far. This is your last chance, Mr. Granger. Give me a quote from the book! Hey, hey, hey you don't, you don't hit no man of peace, no government witness. <laughs> Calloway said you was full of piss, but he didn't tell me the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girly. Only you ain't worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose? Well, seeing as I cleaned up this pig's die, I figure I'm in my rights to wreck it. Let's see. You don't want to do that? You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick! You walk away right now. Don't do it! There you go. No. No. No! You did not! You just took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Boy, that's real nasty. You earned yourself a killing. And I'm gonna enjoy it now. Draw! It's gonna be the last thing you do.
coming. How's it old McKinney's place this week? Yeah! He raised another sagebrush crop this season. <laughs> yeah, that's what been said. See you at the saloon later! Hello, mister. Howdy. Are things well with you? Do I look happy?
in the wrong camp, stranger. <sighs> you don't want to die for Hernandez, do you? Take me to him. I got some questions to ask. Uh, okay. If it's just questions, she's up in the cabin. Don't shoot this fool! He's having words with the boss. Watching you go real easy. Blacko Hernandez! I don't want any trouble. I'm here to speak with you. About boy Callaway. I'm unarmed. I just want to talk. My boy Callaway? Sure. Here's your message. Easy, easy.
That ought to do her. Well, the other day I seen some poor bastard get bushwhacked by a group of street rats. Swarmed on him like a pack of wolves. Just how it is around. This Lamoan air is free for you. Don't want any trouble. Just passing through. You look like you might need a few smacks to set you straight. Be smart and keep dumb, okay? <sighs> you threatening me, you piss ant? Stupid bastard's got a problem with authority. Aim it against. Well, I guess I was told. <laughs> Easy now. Welcome, mister. First time to my shop. Really, you won't regret it. This man deserves no earthly respect from us. As a sign of respect to our creator, we pay respect to the dead. Oh, Father, what do we say about a man who lost his way so awfully? He carried that awful war with him, rustling horses with a misguided gang of killers. A brave man, undone by pride, doomed to a life of sin and vice. Let us pray for this man, O oh Father, provide him mercy. Amen. Those were kind words, Father. Maybe. But what good are words? <sighs> okay, then. You take care. <gasps> Enough! Let's see what the law says! <gasps> Just blazing about, huh? Oh, you think you're real clever, huh? Just exactly how dumb are you? So, you uh, want this to get ugly? Uh, 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 u
see what the law says. Uh! Things. I saw my brother die. I saw my friends die. My, I saw my leg. Hey, mister. Will you give me some money? Sure. Old man Jones nearly killed his wife. Well, right thank now. you. <laughs> say, say, where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from around here. If that was you, I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, yeah ever since them, them greys moved here. They're a bunch of no-good white trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, I reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Tom fell off his ladder yesterday. I think he would have died if it weren't for that bale of hay. Hi there, folks. I'm sure you've got things to do. Don't let me keep you. Okay, girl. Quick work. What can I do for you, sir? There's an old gunslinger I'm looking for. I heard he comes through here. Name of Midnight Billy. Oh, that old soak? Yeah, he spends days on board these trains, but he's going nowhere but the gutter. I imagine you'll find him right in the next one through here. Either that or the next one. Try them both. Look in the bar car. Mr. Midnight? Excuse me, I'm trying to drink. Mr. Midnight, listen. This won't take a moment. I just want to talk with you. 
about your old days as a shootist. Howdy, friend. Get away from me! Hey! I didn't shoot him in his sleep! No one's I saying it! I didn't shoot him in his sleep, and if I did, it was the only way! Not a problem. I'm here about Jim Boy Calloway, and no one shot him yet. I knew you'd come for me! Get away from me! Mr. Midnight! Uh. Come on, girl. to our place. I got away, but they got my wife. Please, mister. You gotta do something. All right. Where is she? She's a sack down in the swamp by the water. <laughs> okay. Go on. See if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. Oh. Uh, I go about finding more help. Let's... Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
her brother died and look at you for one more second. Oh, you gonna hurt you my sons of bitches I can torture innocent women. Another guardian angel like you. One more. I put away in the sack there. It ain't enough, but please take it. Oh, thank you again. You my garden angel. Appreciate it. Good luck to you.
You there? Who? Hello? You a bounty hunter? Well, not right now, I ain't. You Black Bell? I'd like to talk to you about your Wild West days. I don't care much for reminiscing. You got any friends as bounty hunters? None that spring to mind. Well, then you done led them boys here, and you none the wiser. Ah, those bounty hunters. Knew my luck had run out sooner or sooner. Well, get inside. I'll tell them you're gone. Oh, no, no. I ain't hiding from them scalp hunters. Not running from them, neither. And fighting? Yeah, if it's just me against Sam, <laughs> that'd be a waste of time and nitroglycerin. Well, let me know what I can do. You want that Wild West story, don't you? Yes, I do. All right. Get up here, quick. Now, when I give you the word, hit that. Whole place is wired. Black Bell, I got a contract here for your life or your liberty. We'd sooner it be liberty. That's mighty reasonable, mister. Come here, let me take a look at it. Come on. Oh, come on. Stop just there. Now. Got them scalp hunters off your back. Uh, for now. For now. So, you gonna tell me about your Wild West days running with Jim Boy Calloway? Little Boy Calloway? <laughs> the only running he did was away from a fight. And that's about the end of it. Well, a man's apparently a famous gunslinger. Yeah, so they say. But uh, don't get what's famous confused with what's true. The ones of us that lived that life, we was too busy being scared for our scalp to talk to no newspaper writers or dime novel men. Well, what were they like then? Those days they all talk about. <sighs> Same as now, I guess. Only longer ago. <laughs> all right. I'm gonna need your picture, too, if it ain't a trouble. No, sir, no trouble at all. Can't be worse than those awful drawings on the wanted posters. <laughs> Hell, great. Well, you stand over there and uh, let me get this thing ready. Uh, ready? How do you want me? Like this?
Okay, I got it. Then I guess they'll be on my way. Here. <laughs> well, thank you, Mrs. Bell. You gonna be all right? Oh, been running for 20 years. Suppose I'll be running till I drop. Just the way it is. Yep. Good luck. <laughs>